Welcome to the Moffitt Library. In the library, students have access to thousands of books, encyclopedias, films, articles, newspapers, magazines, and various equipment. Any library can feel like a maze to a newcomer. This is why we're here to give a tour of the Moffitt Library. First things first, where even is the Moffitt Library? The library is located on the east side of the campus. For reference, the Sun Watcher statue by Clark Student Center is looking in its direction. The library has three floors, but like a diligent reader, we'll just take it one story at a time. Welcome to the lobby. In the lobby, you'll find a Starbucks and some vending machines. There's also various equipment for students to use, such as a copy machine, a really nice scanner, and a WIPA. There are WIPAs all across campus made for printing material at a low cost for students. It makes sense to have one conveniently placed in the Moffitt Library. Thanks for visiting the lobby. Step through these detectors and we enter Learning Commons. On the left, we have the helpful people at the Checkout and Infotech. Checkout can help with nearly any library need. If there's anything needed to check out, be it a study room, a pod, a book, dry erase mark, or a movie, or if you have any questions, they can help you. Infotech is a new service at the library, helping with computer-related problems. It's helpful to have one in an increasingly digital future. Across the room is the Learning Center. This holds the Tutor Lab. Look at their hours, sign in, and they can help you one-on-one. -on -one. The books on this floor range from letters A through E. Floor 2 has F through M, and Floor 3 has N through Z. Understand that the books are shelved by subject, not by alphabetical order of the titles or the author. If you need help finding a book, consult the online catalog, or ask a librarian at the Infotech desk or through the online chat system. Moffitt even has hundreds of DVDs, VHSs, CDs, and cassettes students can check out and watch. There's more than books and rooms to check out at the library. There are also some great equipment. We have anatomical models for hands-on study sessions, some video equipment such as cameras and backgrounds, VHS players and accompanying television sets, webcams, retro game consoles, and advanced calculators. There are even vinyl records to check out. The only books students cannot check out are the reference books. You may have noticed these rooms embedded in certain sections of the library. These are pods. If you need a promised place for peace or conversation, check out a pod. They're great for group sessions. Toward the back, on the right, there is the Tutoring and Academic Support Program, or TASP. They're here to help with homework, no appointment required. The library also has movie nights. Movies are regularly shown at the screening center at the back of the building. Follow the library on social media channels for any upcoming events. Well, that's everything for the first floor. Let's make our way to the second floor using the elevator in the back. There's also a staircase located by the learning center at the front of the building. Welcome to the second floor. It's another great place to study and relax. Here we have a variety of children's toys and books, which are an especially great resource for budding teachers and educators. Over on the shelf here we have newspapers and magazines. They're updated frequently and no subscription required. The second floor also holds the computer lab. Be sure to check that out. Only a few steps away are the dozens and dozens of individual study pods. These are whole rooms dedicated to privacy and being free of distractions. 
And while you're here on the second floor, be sure to check out special collections. Finally, on the third floor, we have a nice and quiet place to study. Thank you for joining us at the Moffitt Library. We hope you make great use of it.